So back in uh, January, some of our friends decided to fight the Bureau of Land Management and we were trying to build a case against them using their own facility and their own records as evidence. They took over a wildlife sanctuary. One of them was killed with his hands in the air. He was executed, assassinated, because he was the mouthpiece of the entire group. He was the... His name was Lavoy Finnicum, and I've uh, I followed the story very closely. I had a lot, a lot of friends there. And the night that it happened, um, I was so angry. I didn't, I didn't know what to do with myself. I don't remember the last time I was that angry. And I'm, I'm pissed off a lot of the time. There's a lot of things to be pissed off about. But I try, I try to hate anger. But I, I felt a lot of that dark, dark emotion. And around one o'clock in the morning, something hit me. It was like the Holy Spirit came and just hit me like a wave of energy. And it knocked all that stuff out of me. It was completely gone. And a few moments later, something else hit me. And I heard the words, he was a man who loved to walk the land. He turned his cheek, but also took a stand. And I wrote, the, I had my laptop open in my, in my legs and I just started, I just typed those words down. And I wrote this whole song. And uh, the, ne the next day, we put it on YouTube, and the next day, it had like 4,000 views in you know, just like a couple of hours. And it had 10,000 views a couple of hours after that. And it went semi-viral, I think. And I started getting a lot of, a lot of calls about it. And then I got, a, I got a call from his daughter, the boy's daughter. And she told me they were all sitting around the computer listening to the song at their house crying and holding each other and like listening to it over and over and several of his kids have told me that this song is it showed them that their dad was not going to die in vain that he was not going to be forgotten and i told them as long as i live i'll keep singing this song and, uh, so i've gotten to know their his family and i'm very proud to know them this is called uh, the ballad of the boy finnegan cowboy stand to see Take a stand. When his conviction called, he followed what he felt was right. There's no telling just what time you bring. You can live for nothing or for everything. But when the push is come to shove and tell me, will you find? I know not what course 
so the men may take and see the foot of the road. But as for me and mine, make no mistake, the weight of justice is a heavy load, and I'm living by a code. He lived his whole day for a day. a different land, but in the end it was a bullet exposed the lies. The truth remembered is a battle won, though this murder cannot be undone. It rings out like an echo, thunder across the Freedom. Why do we watch them from afar with hearts of stone? Is riding off to the city town where the thoughts of many from the voice of one will drive on, cowboy. Your work is done. America, stand. The night is far spent. The Constitution has been shredded, but it lives in your heart. You know what freedom is and what freedom isn't. Stand, because when you stand, others will stand with you. And God can't stand with you if you don't stand. Once you stand, you can expect the hand of providence to be over you. No matter how it ends, it matters how you stand. This is LaVoy Finnicum, One Cowboy Stands for Freedom. See you later. <laughs>